Good morning. Earlier we were seeing some heavy thick flakes, but now a little lighter, but the wind is certainly still going. You can see on the roof of a hotel here across from us just how much snow is being blown off the roof there. But Pendant says because the snow is really wet, that it doesn't expect drifting to be a major problem. The roads here are just really covered with a thick layer of slush, but I just stepped in the, the puddle to make sure it was that a puddle and not ice, and that is the case. We're actually standing right across the street from the PennDOT headquarters here on Route 30. I'm about to lose my umbrella. It's so windy out here. PennDOT says that its trucks have been out since 1 o'clock this morning. It did not pre-treat the roadways because it started out with rain, so it said all that material would have just washed away, but it is putting down salt now and getting ready to start plowing even with this slush because it is concerned that if the snow comes down at one to two inches per hour, which is what PennDOT expects, it may not be able to keep up. That's pretty significant. So, uh, you know, for most of our routes, uh, even a minimum is like two hours to get around, and that's just during a, a spreading storm. And if we're plowing, that takes a little longer. I did just check in with emergency dispatchers for Lancaster County, and they say they have no significant problems across Lancaster County right now. And we see traffic seeming to be going at a normal pace here with no problems. But again, Penn urges you to use caution for your morning commute. In Lancaster County, Caitlin Smith, News 8.